we revised the outlook on the non-life global reinsurance market segment outlook to stable from negative. There were a lot of things that went into our decision to do that, but one of the primary factors was um, our expectation that non-traditional capacity that's been um, affecting the property catastrophe market will show a little bit more discipline after um, difficult returns in 2017 and then followed up by uh, lackluster returns in 2018. That in line with uh, interest rates going up, which should produce um, more favorable investment income over time, although there is some short-term pain flowing through income statements right now with unrealized losses. But overall, um, we're expecting that to be a benefit. It could also impact um, how involved the non-traditional capacity, um, how involved they get in, and continue to be in the reinsurance market because there might be alternative investment options out there for them now that interest rates have gone up. AMBES expects to see over the near to midterm a continued alignment between traditional and non -re and non traditional reinsurers. Um, I think the Markel Nafila transaction is something that we're, we're going to see where these these marriages, um, whether it's uh, a non traditional capital provider buying a traditional or, or the other way around. I think we're also going to continue to see uh, heavy competition in the sector. I, I think that's will always be here to stay and probably a little bit more consolidation. Um, it likely happened in spurts or, or a little bit over time, but uh, it's certainly something our, we expect to see continue going forward.